what's good everyone welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna to be showing you guys my favorite fresh fragrances as you know I am obsessed with fresh fragrances like hands down my favorite fragrance category by far so I got some to show you guys today if you want a part two definitely let me know because oh my gosh you guys like I have so many fresh fragrances and when I was looking through my collection I was like oh I want to include this but then I'm gonna be sitting here all day explaining like a million fragrances so anyways if you enjoy this video for sure like comment as well as subscribe also go follow me on social media tiktok instagram snapchat you know the deal with that and let's get right into it so the first fragrance i have to mention first because i have not mentioned her in a minute why exactly i have no idea i think it's because i'm afraid of using it up because it is retired but of course you guys can find this on like mercari so this is from last year this is dance in the freaking rain you guys like dance in the rain is just on another level like it's on another level this fragrance is very earthy but definitely has aquatic elements of course it smells so fresh and so good i wish that i had the body cream to it last year if you guys have been following my channel since then you know i wasn't really into like buying lotions to match every single fragrance and now like i literally cannot have a lotion for a fragrance like it literally irks me beyond belief but this stuff you guys is so fresh so good the lasting power is all right i would say it's definitely medium strength it's just a fragrance that I have never smelled before from Bath & Body Works or Victoria's Secret. It's something very original and I can't believe when I first smelled this in the store last year I didn't like it because it is literally one of my favorite fragrances of all time. I wish they would bring this back. For some reason I feel like they're not going to bring it back but they need to. Like out of the entire collection last year this um, came out in the Daydream collection and why Daydream was the star of the show and not Soak in the Sun or Dance in the Rain I have no idea because these slap they are so good. Okay moving on this next one I'm going to go into a Victoria's Secret fragrance is Santorini Neroli Water. Now this is crazy you guys it is so gorgeous i only have one mist but i do have two lotions oh my god it's so fresh this is amazing because it goes with so many different fragrances like dolce and gabbana like blue gingham this goes really beautifully with like i have so many different combos for this and it's just the freshest thing ever it literally smells expensive that's the dope part about having fresh fragrances is smelling clean literally smells expensive like I do not know how to describe it but you guys know what I mean I wanted to include Alco Kiss in this video but I included that in my favorite floral fragrance video but it also is like an aquatic fresh fragrance maybe we'll mention her at the end you guys already know though how much I love Alco Kiss that I want to shed some light on stuff that you might not know about or may not know that I love so yes this stuff is amazing for a fresh fragrance the lasting power is great of course i would say medium strength it's very hard to find yourself a long long lasting fresh fragrance usually you know more warm fragrances tend to latch onto clothes and skin a little bit better for lasting power wise but yes please pick this up if you can it's one of those that i think is completely worth it to go buy off mercari it's just so so beautiful and i'm obsessed Okay, this next one, let's also, you know what, we'll go into a Bath & Body Works one. This next one is Beautiful Day. Now, I mentioned this in a few videos ago, but this stuff is just beautiful. Like, literally so fresh and clean. This smells like a white t-shirt to me. Like, literally just a clean outfit, like a white t-shirt and jeans. Like, that is what I get it's stunning and you get that light apple note so the fragrance notes are actually on the back thank god the fragrance notes are sun-kissed apple sparkling cases wild daisies i love anything with like daisies in it pink peony and fresh woods and that woodsy note at the end just chills it all out just evens it out literally grounds the fragrance but the apple in here keeps it really fresh and really beautiful and 
it's a fragrance just that you need in your collection if you don't have her she's another one i was not a big fan of at first then i became obsessed with this fragrance it's just so clean i kind of want to put it on today you guys i do not have fragrance on today because i have self tanner on but of course i'm going to spray a fragrance on my clothes but like I don't know which one there's so many options you guys you know being like a body care collectors it can be overwhelming to pick out a fragrance like it's literally like picking out an outfit I'm like okay what I'm wearing right now what the heck is gonna go well with it and what is really gonna shine so you guys you know the struggle <laughs> all right moving down the line this one is from Victoria's Secret now this is new this is calm water it's insane it's just insane this is stunning it is so fresh and so good it says in here water lily and juicy pear and the pear it says juicy pear but it's not very like strong of pear and it's not something like super super sweet it's very light hey ma and it's something that's very light sweet and not overboard so it keeps it really fresh so don't get turned off by the pear note in here and i'm usually not a person who loves pear notes to begin with but in this fragrance it's needed like it's so fresh it's gorgeous it's literally just smells clean and i love this stuff just getting out of the shower like i adore putting that stuff on the lotion is amazing love the packaging like come on you need this in your bathroom like you literally need it in your bathroom i love it so very much the feel of it is just like oh i can't and you know what it's simplistic packaging but it's so like tasteful like i just really really think that this is overall a great fragrance same thing medium lasting power really really amazing okay this next one is Underwater Oasis. Now, the thing with Underwater Oasis is the lasting power is horrible. You guys know I'm always going to keep it real. The lasting power is actually horrific. But it's so good. And like if you spray enough of this and you put on a lotion, you could get a little bit of wear out of it. And if you spray a perfume on top of it, it's perfect. So the keynotes in here are sparkling bergamot, jasmine, which I love anything with jasmine in it, bamboo, marine notes, and blue musk, which I really like the slight little bit of musk. It's so tasteful. It is a beautiful fragrance, and I'm just obsessed with this. Even though the lasting power isn't great, I will always have it in my collection because it's very amazing to like wear when you get out of the shower. This next one is a new one. This is Falling Water, and this is a part of their, their new collection, so you can go get it right now. It says, again, Dewy Pear. They be adding pear to, like, a lot of new fragrances. Blue Moss and Mesmerizing Moment. And, again, the pear in here is tasteful. Now, I'm going to compare these two because they are very different. Very different. I think people think just because things have certain notes in it that they are similar, but these are like totally different. This is gorge. Like literally gorge. It literally just smells like a clean vacation. It smells like a beautiful hotel room and like you know that like fresh smell when you're at the shore. Like literally I talk to you guys like everyone's from New Jersey. This stuff is definitely beautiful. Again, I love the packaging. I feel like Victoria's Secret does um, aquatic fragrances super, super well. It smells expensive. Like it really does. This will be a fragrance that I do not want not in my collection. Like, did that make any sense? I do not want to go without this ever. I'm going to stock up on this during the um, semi annual sale. All right, this next one is Sea Island Cotton. I have the body spray somewhere somewhere in here but like i do not know where right now it's somewhere on my desk or somewhere over there but yes the sea island cotton sea island cotton is just amazing by the way the body cream especially lasts so long and the lasting power is crazy on this and the spray they're very strong literally like the strongest fresh fragrance that i do own which is great because the lasting power is amazing so the keynotes are crisp white cotton clean linen fresh orange blossom blue freesia and ocean musk and yes that musk note is pretty strong in here 
feel like if you don't like musk, like if you hate it, you might smell this and be like, mm, not a fan, but like, no, it is so good. It is so fresh, but strong and like expensive. Like, it's crazy. And I've been wearing this fragrance, you guys, for so long. I am beyond obsessed with Calgon Morning Glory. I need to try the other ones. You guys tell me that the other ones are absolutely amazing as well. By the way, um, Chloe Yasmin, she talked about this on her channel, so it inspired me to buy it, and I'm so happy that I did. Truly, like, top five favorite fragrances of all time. Like, literally, this stuff's crazy. It is so good. I almost put it on my nose. It's amazing. The lasting power, absurd for a fresh fragrance. So stinking good. Like, this is just to die for. I got it at Walmart. I think I paid like six bucks, which is amazing. You need it. If you don't have it, you love fresh fragrances, you gotta go get this. And if you don't like florals, still go get this. It is a great fragrance to start off with when you're trying to like get into floral fragrances. It's fresh, it's sexy, it's expensive smelling. Like it is just absolutely out of this world and you need it in your collection. You could wear it literally anywhere anywhere you could wear this daytime nighttime it's one of those that just works because it's so fresh and it's just absolutely out of this world this next one again i cannot find the body spray in my collection right now it is somewhere to be found but i do have the perfume and the body lotion this is from bath and body works now this is gingham and gingham is beautiful like beautiful they should never ever get rid of gingham because i will be heartbroken the keynotes in here are blue freesia i love anything with freesia like i love white peach fresh clementine anything of the clementine no you guys know like clementine and fragrances kills me i'm just obsessed like, i'm literally obsessed violet and clean musk and this is just so gorgeous i will never get over this i'm in love like I'm literally in love. I would marry this fragrance. I'm not kidding. It is, again, one of those you could wear any time of day because fresh fragrances just work for all times of day. You could wear this out to lunch, breakfast, nighttime. Like, it does not matter. Fresh fragrances just work. And I'm telling you guys, like, I feel like guys specifically like, like, warm fragrances and whatnot. But I have to say, like, my boyfriend especially, he loves when I wear, like, fresh fragrances. Like, that is the thing that if I'm wearing something fresh, like, he's like, oh my god, you smell so good. And actually, my boyfriend loves, loves Jimmy Choo by Jimmy Choo. Like, whenever I wear that, he's like, ooh, you smell so good. I'm like, I know. Yes, yeah, so I'm not going to touch on gingham too much because you guys know my love for gingham. It's just uh, amazing. The lasting power is not the best, but get the perfume. You'll be smelling like it all day long. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, for sure, like, comment, and subscribe. As well as follow me on social media, which will definitely be down in the description box. I love you all. God bless you. God is so good. I appreciate and love all of you so much from the bottom of my heart. And I will see you guys in my next video.